What's up, Facebook family? You know, I always got something beneficial to say, and I, I got to share it, man. I was just um, thinking about, I was in a conversation on Facebook about um, is an ongoing argument and blame, you know, going on about the so-called black struggle and the people. Okay, um, I don't know if y'all know, but I don't consider myself black. I don't consider myself an African American. Um, I do consider myself of those people who are referring to themselves with those names that were given to them. Um, I am a person who um, associates myself with um, the downtrodden um, poor, um, the most unfortunate people in the United States of America. Um, not only because of my skin color, that's foolishness. Um, it's also because of my race. And my race um, is not dictated by my skin color, but mm -hmm. Um, it's the fact that I am an American who um, don't know its history and don't know where we came from. I uh, can't even say that I was uh, brought over here from Africa. But um, one thing I'm not going to do is make up things and hold on to this false um, pride and saying that I'm a black man and I'm proud to be a black man and creating my own um, identity and history and and coming up with a whole ideology and um, this is idol worshiping and this is the worst form of belief so you know um, also I am of a person who accepted Islam who accepted um, a religion that was uh, or if you may say found or started in um, you know beginning of time you know but it's from the uh, Africa Middle East the eastern part of the world uh, where the religions and the prophets came for those who believe um, now the topic I wanted to sh point out today is cleanliness because a lot of these so-called people that's trying to find their self, well, we are people that's trying to find ourselves, but we're so-called African-American or black. But we are a people, and we all have, have something in common, and we are strong, and we have been making great uh, um, success throughout, throughout this history as an Americans, as less fortunate Americans. Uh, as Americans who um, intentionally have been um, rejected and cursed, you know, cursed upon. Um, so, one thing that these people, our people, do is we try to grab onto things and we try to claim things. And, you know, unfortunately, once we grab something, we hold on with our dear life like our molar teeth we hold on strong and even if it's wrong we hold pride in those things like pork you know um, uncleanliness and that's the main topic not cleaning yourself urine and defecation must be cleaned off constantly through the day and a lot of women especially because you have an open wound and you must clean that every day with fresh water and, and soap and things like that. But in this society, we've been kept away from those things because the people that was uh, dominating us in this society evilly um, are people who don't have these same cleanness traditions in their genes. So we've been taking on their traditions. Um, 
and that's not, I'm not trying to jump on the whole race. I'm not trying to say that uh, these are the opposite of what we are. We are better than them. No, because what makes you better is how much do you fear in your Lord? How much conscious are you of the fact of the stuff that I'm telling you? How conscious of you are of your cleanliness? How conscious are you that when you get off of the toilet, you need to wipe your urine? How conscious are you that you shouldn't be walking around with urine in your, 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 and defecation streaks in your underwear? This is very unhealthy, very nasty. And uh, cursing each other, cursing your children. You know, and this cursing is the opposite of prayer. You know, when you say to hell with you, damn you, F you, mother F and B and this and that. You can call each other B's. These things are curses you're putting upon your own people, the people you are around, your companions. Those are your people, you know. Whoever your companions, that's who you are. If you're hanging around dogs or you're hanging around cats, if you're hanging around animals all your life, you are an animal. You are what you hang around, just like you are what you eat. So I'm just sharing all this little quick information because it came to my heart and I just wanted to share with y'all guys, man. It's more from where that came from. Came, come to um, uh, Rob Palaz, Yahoo, uh, YouTube, Rob Palaz, boxing. Because boxing rules the world everything revolving around boxing right now defend yourself at all times peace